This day in American history, February the 3rd, the four chaplains of World War II in the early hours of February the 3rd, 1943, the U.S. Army troop ship Dorchester steamed through the icy waters of Torpedo Alley, some 100 miles off the coast of Greenland. The ships, carrying more than 900 men, was having a rough go of it. Winter winds screeched across the North Atlantic, and heavy seas pounded the bow. Beneath the frenzied surface lurked a German submarine. At 12.55 a.m., a torpedo ripped into the Dorchester side, and immediately the ship started to sink. Desperate soldiers rushed topside, stumbling toward lifeboats and jumping overboard. Amid the confusion, four army chaplains worked quietly and methodically, calming the soldiers, directing them toward lifeboats, and handing out life jackets. When they ran out, they took off their own life jackets and put them on other men. They were four chaplains of different faiths, Jewish Rabbi Alexander Good, Catholic priest John Washington, and Protestant ministers George Fox and Clark Pauling. They had joined the U.S. Army to tend to the spiritual needs of the troops. Now, in this hour of urgent need, they put their courage and faith to work so others might live. As the ship slid beneath the surface, soldiers in the lifeboats took on one last look at the Dorchester. They saw the four chaplains standing on deck, arms linked, praying. Rescue ships plucked 230 men from the sea, but 672 died in the freezing Atlantic. The four chaplains were not among the survivors. They were always together, one of the soldiers later said. They carried their faith together. The four chaplains died as they lived, serving their country, their fellow men, and God. Thanks for listening. Have a good evening.